Welcome to the IEP Technologies Virtual Reality Processing Facility. Here, we could be processing any one of many common dusts like food, pharmaceuticals, or chemicals. Our process is operating normally, with a slurry entering the spray dryer, then being conveyed to the cyclone separator, where the finer particles are separated and drawn up to the dust collector. Feel free to take a closer look at the process line in action. This process is operating normally, although it is just an ignition source away from a devastating industrial explosion. The process appeared to be operating normally, but every ingredient required for a dust explosion was present. First, we had fine dry dust. When this fuel was combined with oxygen and dispersed in a confined vessel, all that was needed was an ignition source, and in this case, an upset condition in the form of an exothermic reaction from material buildup in the spray dryer created the ember that triggered the explosion. The pressure wave and flame front moved rapidly upstream to the interconnected This propagation from the initial explosion disturbed dust in the plant, which created an even greater hazard. The resulting secondary explosion can be even more devastating than the initial event. Let's take a closer look at the pressure levels in the dust collector as the explosion occurred. On this graph, you can see a rapid pressure increase occur in less than 100 milliseconds. That's three times faster than the blink of an eye. When the pressure reaches the maximum level, the process vessel is unable to contain the explosion. But what if the pressure could be held below the vessel's limits? This line represents the reduced pressure to which our protection solutions are designed to limit pressure buildup. Let's go back and see how implementing solutions from IEP can mitigate the effects of a dust explosion in the milliseconds that it takes for one to occur. IEP Technologies provides a complete range of explosion protection solutions. The most common and least complicated option is the explosion vent. A standard vent panel is installed on the dust collector and ducted through the wall to a safe area outside. It is designed to relieve pressure. However, the fireball can be up to eight times the volume of the vessel and needs to be directed to a safe area outside of the building, ensuring the fireball will not lead to an unsafe situation. Protecting the spray dryer and cyclone separator is an active suppression solution which consists of smart DS intelligent pressure sensors reporting to a multi-zone control panel and high-speed IEP suppressors. Regardless of the type of explosion protection employed, it is important to utilize isolation barriers between vessels. This prevents an explosion from traveling to interconnected vessels and creating a secondary explosion. On our line, we use both a flap valve and chemical isolation. Let's watch now how external venting plus passive isolation will protect the dust collector and upstream vessels. As you can see, we were able to safely vent the explosion outside the building while isolating the upstream equipment from a secondary explosion. When external venting is not possible, a flameless vent may be an option. In this case, we will use our EVN flameless vent. With this in place, any flame from an explosion is arrested and the gas is cooled. In this scenario, we will also utilize chemical isolation in multiple areas. Again, we have successfully vented the explosion and prevented it from traveling to other parts of our process. But what if the ignition source finds the perfect conditions for an explosion in a different vessel? Let's take a look at an explosion which occurs in the cyclone. The Smart ES Intelligent Pressure Sensor detects the pressure wave at the earliest stage and then communicates this to our control panel. Within milliseconds, the controller actuates the high-speed suppressors. They deliver a suppressant which stops the combustion process before critical pressure levels are reached. As you can see, the IEP suppression system coupled with isolation devices work together to stop the explosion in its tracks. Each explosion threat creates a unique challenge. Many variables can impact the explosion risks and influence the decision on the best protection solution. IEP Technologies can guide you through the decision-making process from understanding the threats present in your facility to determining if venting, suppression, isolation, or a combination will provide the best possible level of protection for your particular process.
Let IEP Technologies and Herbiger Safety Solutions develop a solution to ensure your process remains online and your employees remain safe. Together, we save lives.